Alright, we're back. First thing I want to do is check mail. The uh, only thing we got quest-wise was from Brawl Tavar. Deepest thanks, honored Imperial representative. I am extremely pleased to report that Circa Corellia operations have managed to resume in the wake of your humbling and potent attack. We have all doubled our efforts to ensure that we can put our full production capacity into the Empire's service as quickly as possible. I've attached a small token of our unending gratitude and loyalty. Please enjoy it in good health and victory. With utmost respect, Brawl Tavar. Scar, I might have to mute it a few times. It throat's all wackety. Awesome Chinese. And it was awesome. I love that place that I order from. Flashpoint Courier. Ruined. Finished! Those Blastosalonians with their riots and their mangy hides. And Too busy fighting the Empire to think about the working man, the entrepreneur. Tell me you're not going to cry. I just don't like those animals getting between me and my payday. Major Traddick's expecting me to deliver a shipment of military-grade ordnance, but the Furball Coalition won't even let a rumor get through. It's not just the Salonians, either. Wookies, Strahl... Just about every flea bag in the galaxy is stonewalling me. It's not too late to fight back. I sell the goods. I don't use them. I'm sure you don't give a Cathar's hackles about me, but there's an entire regiment of Imperial troops waiting for this gear. If you clear out those mongrels, I should be able to deliver the merchandise. Heck, I'll cut you in on a slice of the profits. We have an agreement. So you'll do it? Maybe I'm not headed for financial ruin after all. The Wookiees and the Drawl are the ones I'm most concerned about. Thin their numbers a bit, and we'll be in business. Hell yes. Killing Wookiees? Perfection delivered, my... Master. Welcome to the Blitz, sir. Darth Decimus said to roll out the red carpet, but I wasn't expecting such an esteemed operative. What we've got here is a clean-up operation. Factories were moving massive amounts of supplies to rebels across Corellia. Bomber brigades came in. We rained fire on their heads, ripped the factories apart. We just need to beat down the rebels hiding out inside. What are we waiting for? My boys are in the field, but the enemy's tearing them apart. Now that you're here, we can revise our attack. We're getting intel from an inside source. Unfortunately, his dalliances with the local women make him perpetually late. Manners, Major Tradic. We all have our vices. I'm sorry we haven't met. I'm Darbin Sul, Corellia's top counselor, friend to the Empire. I hope the Major hasn't dirtied my reputation. Why is a Corellian aiding the Empire? I've always been a firm supporter of the Empire. And the promise to become Corellia's Prime Minister didn't hurt. I have friends, you know, acquaintances in the Resistance. I pretend I'm sympathetic to their fight, and they tell me things, like who's supplying them. Certain factories were churning out military-grade munitions, battle droids, you name it. All donated right to the Resistance across the Core Worlds. That's why we bombed those factories into an inferno. Not quite the subtle approach I hoped for. The bombardment trapped the Rebels in the burning wreckage. Now they're angry, desperate, and sitting on the largest weapons stockpile in the core. If the Rebels get those weapons functional, we may as well abandon Corellia. Get ready to see how intelligence handles things. Those Corellians fight dirty. Whatever munitions they've got have downed every squad sent their way. You'll do better. Just wipe out their weaponry. If I know my people, they'll bow to the Empire once their hope is crushed. I... <clears throat> yeah, I did. Wow. <clears throat> I, uh... <laughs> I lost dark side too. Too many light side choices. Alright. Dead. Oh, 
General Mother Hesker sent someone to check on me, eh? Well, we're just about to start the fireworks. The Corellian Star Drive Corporation has been funding resistance cells all over the city. So I'm turning their headquarters into a crater. As soon as I get the all clear from my buddy down there, I'll flip the switch and... Boom. No more corporation. Rebellion like that cannot go unpunished. Agree. They're the biggest corporation on Corellia, so they thought the Empire wouldn't slap them down. This should... Ah, oh, there's my call. Blow it, quick! They know we're here! Repeat, the Republic's found us! Blow it! Last! Long-range detonator's not working. The pups must have put a dampening field up. Surely you must have thought something like this might happen. I'd be pretty lousy at my job if I didn't have a backup plan. Just didn't see it getting this bad. A short-range detonator will still blow the charges, but you'd have to fight half the pub army while doing it. I wouldn't last ten seconds. Respectfully, sir, you've got to help. I'll clean up your failure, but Central Command will hear about this. Report me. As long as you're willing to blow this plant to the outer rim, there's a delay on each bomb after it's triggered. That'll give you time to get out of the blast zones. Don't stick around after you set them off. The timer's not that long. And it's a big boom. <clears throat> it's like 1.3 seconds. Heal yourself up, Wexel. Don't worry. Those savages will be punished. Forgive my sentiments, sir, but it's it's a relief to have someone of your caliber and dedication here at last. It's the Wookiees. Shaggy boots tore into my men with a vengeance. Less than a third of us escaped, and most look worse than Wexel here. We're a long way from Kashyyyk. What are Wookiees doing on Corellia? Corellians like them as factory workers. They're supposedly industrious, clever with tools, and have strong backs. My men have been converting Corellian factories for the Empires. No problems until we got to the Magna Gravitics plant. The Wookiees in the plant refused to hand it over. They ambushed us, and now they're holding the factory. It's a bitter pill. An example needs to be made of them. It'll be dangerous. The Wookiees aren't interested in negotiation or reason. They know every nook of that factory. And now, they've had time to make ready. You're going into Corellia's own savage jungle. Hopefully we can raise a glass when it's all done. Our task is complete. Alright. <clears throat> I've just been setting them for lockboxes lately. report when we're done. I'll get right on it. I also... I also sold stuff. Alright, let's see here. <clears throat> Upgrade. So let's see. 1526. 16. Not much of an upgrade, but... No, try not to... My throat too much in the mic. But sometimes Chinese will do that. <clears throat> Cause my throat keep trying to lock up. But it's so good, I don't care. Star Drive Combustion. Damn, what the hell is that? I'll just sneak around those two.
<coughs> just unlearn the heroic tube. Bye bye. What a mess. Stabbed. Man, I feel kind of groggy since I hate now. Hey guys! Oh yeah. Wait, nope. There we go. Pissy there. For some reason. Go ahead and drink our drink. Steak and last step. Well, didn't kill him, but hurt him pretty good. Run! Hey, brother! Awesome. Very quiet explosion, though. blow up the bomb in the meeting room. It's kind of fun to attack a bunch of business areas. We can begin defensive systems. Annihilating enemies. <laughs> I love stabbing. As a sniper. The ah, hell. Of course, Wanderer comes in right now. Please use the bomb. Thank you. Jesus Christ. Moving my keys around, you jackasses. It's like I'm trying to find my ability, but the keys keep flipping back and forth. Operating at maximum efficiency. Insufficient challenge. I agree with that.
Oh, hello, weather bomb. Oops, damn it. I meant to use the other thing. She actually stood up to him pretty well. She didn't take very much damage. I mean, I did use that smoke grenade, but I don't think that helped that much. I wonder if you actually take damage if you stand next to the bomb when it blows up. I want to see if it actually does damage in here. Oh, sweet, yeah. Oh, wow, it does. Sweet, like all the mirrors and glasses are broke. There's fire. That's pretty cool. Pretty lame if it blew up and nothing changed. Alright, now I think we get to kill some Wookiees. What you've all been waiting for. Emperor, favor you, my lord. Our occupation continues as planned. Shame the locals aren't more cooperative. They should be thanking us. Instead, they fight. Call us conquerors, oppressors. The Republic has poisoned their minds. But no matter. Their factories are in ruins, their supplies dwindle. Soon these radicals will be powerless. Right. Good luck with that. They still have plenty of bite, which is why we must defang them. The rebels are scattered, desperate. Reliant on a few supply caches to maintain their resistance. And we've located one such cache. It's heavily guarded, but confiscating those supplies will rob the insurgents of much needed resources. Can I count on you for this? Get ready to see how intelligence handles things. Yeah, that's what he'd say. The rebels are hurting for supplies. They won't give up that cache without a fight. Well, I will bet your mutton chops that I will get it back. Alright, let's go get the cash. Tango and cash. Cash and tango. That was a good 80s movie. Sometimes you have to qualify things. You can't just say, that's a good movie. Because there is a difference between, that's a good movie, and that's a good 80s movie. Right, because... There's a lot of movies from the 80s that they were made now. People would just be like, what the hell is this crap? But because of nostalgia and because we understand that's just the way the 80s were, we can look at that movie and go, that's a good 80s movie. I, I like to watch that. Would I like to see it again? No. Not in a new version. But I'd like to watch that cheesy old movie again. By the way, if you still don't know what I'm talking about, or think that I'm just an asshole liar about the whole button, ability buttons things, watch watch number four. This is a great example. Watch number four. It's heroic uh, moment. And when I do this, it should switch and stay switched as long as I'm in cover. It should stay explosive probe. But uh, as you see, it's already screwed up. See? Explosive probe. I'm not touching anything. All right, this time I didn't switch, but watch it. Okay, so in cover, explosive probe. Out of cover, advanced recon. Now watch it. Staying so far. 
Oh, see? It's advanced recon. And of course, that dumbass is over here, so I can't freaking shoot. But now it's back to explosive probe. It, oh, see, it's this. But we're on the first row. Let's see if I can target something. Ugh, two droids, this is gonna suck. Alright, can't really do it right now. Like the one time I show it, I pick, pick the worst room in the world to do. Alright. This is gonna be kind of a bitch. Actually, he might not be. Yep, so afraid of. Again. <laughs> Boom. Close enough. Guess it doesn't matter. Because we just not a bonus that we need to do. So three more quests left for right now. This planet's pretty big for Let's just turn it. Yep. Well, I guess we have to go over there anyway. And might as well port. That's not right, is it? Yeah, okay, let's go ahead and go back over there. Turn in both those quests and see if there's follow ups or new ones. Amazing! I saw the fires through my optics. Part of me still wishes we could have blown all the charges at once, but that Corellian star drives won't be funneling any more money. This demonstration will remind the other corporations to toe the line. Politics is for the brass and the movers and shakers. I just blow up what they tell me to. You really pulled my fat out of the fire. You ever need some custom work done? I owe you. Yes, yes, you do. And it's best if you remember that. Both of these lose a ton of crit. So I'm not that interested. But for her, it actually might be decent because she gains a little bit of uh, endurance. Because the one implant she's got now has cunning on it for some reason. Hit endurance versus two endurance? Uh, yeah. Yeah. She just has that because I didn't really have anything else to give her. Uh, hello, see. New quest. A Salonian infestation. 
Corellian's future is bright. Commerce, industry, tourism, all will flourish once we wash the rebel element from our streets. The vilest of all rebels are the Salonians, the pestilent, plague-ridden refugees that pollute the tunnels beneath our great city. These rabid animals are not true Corellians, yet they seek to steal our planet. We must defend against them. Purge the traitorous Salonians, safeguard our glory, and the Corellian government will honor your devotion. Hell yeah. Another forest. See, it's good we came back. The flames called you here too, didn't they? Yikes. Pity you missed the show. Our bombs plummeted in silence and blossomed, giving birth to the magnificent inferno. I yearn for the flames' warm embrace. Instead, I can only watch the fire reduce the rebel factories to ash. You're completely insane. Fire is destruction distilled to its purest form. You'd do well to respect it. I came to nurse the inferno and watch the blaze consume the rebels. Sadly, the flames were denied their pleasure. Too many Corellians escaped the fire. Republic doctors treat them, poisoning the survivors against the Empire and fueling their rebellion. If flames won't teach the rebels cooperation, Perhaps they require the Empire's personal touch. Yes, it's the only way. Crush the survivors, and the rebels will realize that defiance earns them death. I'd cast them into the Inferno myself, but the flames, so close, I, I'd never resist them. Perhaps you could fuel the blaze with the rebel blood. I'll make sure there are no survivors. Good. Hello. Find their medical camp. Burn their resistance to the ground. There will be no survivors. There never is. Actually, there is pretty frequently survivors. But we'll ignore that. Now, you guys are quiet since I came back. Not so chatty now, are we? Ah, damn this right contact. I really got to go get some new ones. Noons. What is this supposed to be? Oh, I guess it's small text. Or something. Maybe it's supposed to be like, well, normally it says something, but now because of all the destruction, it's bugged out. Maybe that's what they're going for. Yeah, that is better. Better fill my chat with chat. No, I've got permanent contacts. I have uh, hard contacts. Gas permeable, as they are also known. And I've did the deep cleaning thing a few times. Not seem to really be helping. So I think they're just old. I need to get new ones. I destroyed the rebel supply cache. Then we're one step closer to ending this pointless uprising. You've done the Empire a great service today. We may yet see this planet fall in line. Oh, you will. It will fall in line at the heel of my boot. Excuse me. Not as intimidating when you hiccup halfway through it. How dost we get over there? Okay, I see a small road heading over there. I don't know if that's it, but we're gonna try it by God. Let's see, have about uh, 471 gigs left. And given the time it's been taking to go through hard drive space today, I'd say you get a maybe three hours left, so roughly. So we got a good bit left. I should be able to get well into 49. How else can I assist you? I'm assuming that room has some kind of purpose. 